And yeah, without further ado, Christian, introduce yourself. Thank you very much. Um, my name is Christian Chingaret. I've um, attended my first year of university at Bangor. And so let's hit it go. Let's go. So I'm studying product design at BSC at Bangor University. What's different about Bangor University is actually the university is bigger than the city. The university is 10, no, the city is 10,000, while the university is 12,500. So it's actually a proper university city, which is kind of an interesting experience. I like it because it's a bit like Bermuda in the sense, everything's small and I sort of walk around a bit. So, expectation. You will study at least as hard, if not harder, as you did in I, B, or A level. I kind of find it difficult, I'm sure a lot of you found it difficult, due to different changes and sort of norms. I'd have my parents help me wake up at uh, early mornings, you know, getting myself out of bed, so I kind of found that difficult. Another one, you will be an active member of all the societies. I try to, like, you know, everybody at the beginning of freshman week signs up to every single thing they think they like and enjoy. I've tried a few things, but I'm really into sailing, and so I went away and traveled a bit. I'm also now secretary for sailing, so fingers crossed I do well for that one. Another one, you will love your flatmates and become instant best friends. That's really tough, by the way. Um, because you live, I live with eight, um, seven other people in uh, one sort of, sort of area, and we didn't have catering, so we had to cook ourselves and uh, <laughs> wash dishes. It was kind of an interesting experience, but we had fun and enjoyed it a lot. Expectation: Your course will be interesting and engaging. So um, those two images on the right, yep, yeah, uh, is my project. So I did a light project, and on the left is me starting my work placement first day, which we do eight weeks. So it was. So sort of getting on the workforce, um, learning how to be employed and stuff, kind of interesting. And a bit boring sometimes, though, I have to say to so myself. <laughs> Expectation, you'll be taught in a grand lecture hall. That is my building. <laughs> that is where I spend most of my time, either in the workshop or a classroom with about 24 chairs. I have a uh, cohort of 28 people in my year and 75 people in three years. So it's kind of really small. You'll be the one to stretch your money out. As universities, we all know, we're kind of short in change here. So I have to find out creative ways in uh, stretching the money. First is uh, joining, I joined Chinese society because I'm half Chinese and sort of interesting. And I actually made dumplings. So I had that for dinner one time. That was fun. And uh, cook with friends. Another one, expectations. Freshers week will be the best time of your life. It's fun, it's enjoyable, but they don't tell you about the hangovers. Um, but I'm enjoying it a lot. I had met a lot of new people, and it was sort of a good icebreaker I felt they had with that. So yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> Expectations. You'll be wise and inspiring. Lectures. Are, sorry, you'll be wise and it's very, very inspiring. Lectures are all. It's gonna be inspiring. You can have good bits. You can have bad bits. But overall, I felt it was a good experience, and I sort of like education myself. I like learning new things. But you know, everybody likes sort of different things, and I enjoyed it. Even, okay, even though you struggle at boiling an egg now, you'd be a culinary genius after cooking for yourself. I use eggs a lot because I find it's, it's cheap and I can cook. Scrambled, boiled, fried, put it in rice, it works for everything. As like self-catered, it's good for go. Like you can buy a bunch of eggs and it lasts forever. So enjoy that myself. Oh, apologies for the words, by the way, just sort of quick. Um, expectation, you'll figure out your purpose in life and be the perfect position to achieve this. If anybody knows how to do that, can you please tell me? Because I'm still looking at that at the moment, trying to figure this out. Um, sort of trying different things with product design. There's so many avenues, and I'm trying to understand it sort of thing and get it, grips of it. Another expectation, you'll be a mature and responsible adult. I'm learning very well at this. I'm uh, organizing myself a bit more better than before. I'm getting up on time somewhat. And I'm um, having fun and I'm making appointments for like doctors. It's all this. When you're sick especially, you have to make the calls yourself. It's, it's, it's a learning curve. <laughs> Expectation. You have a fancy new room and kitchen in where you keep tidy. Depending on your dorms and people, it's honestly doesn't work out too well. Some people have OCD and just go absolutely ballistics if you uh, can't keep it tidy. I'm more on the mid-range. I somewhat keep it messy and then I keep it really tidy for a bit. Try that balanced life. Expectation. Ooh. ooh. Oh, what? Wow. We missed a bit. Okay. Uh, this is me going to, I'm traveling a bit. And I went down to London, actually, and I enjoyed myself there. So try to travel a bit. And that's how I got that ice cream. I wouldn't be able to afford it otherwise, sort of thing. It's a bit too expensive for me. So I got my mom to pay for it. Thank you, mom. <laughs> An expectation. 
Life is like a catwalk in university. First three weeks for me, yes it was. After that, sweatpants did the job. And a bit of a scarf, you know, that was a cool Christmas decoration for me. Just kind of enjoyed that a bit. Mm -hmm. Don't have anything else. Okay. Wow, party every night, yeah? University, right? Enjoy it, freshman week. You got, I found out, it's got that work-life balance, sort of partying and organizing yourself, and I thought that was really sort of a key thing. For example, like that lady sleeping on the books, you got to sort of dig your way and find your way to go through the rough bits and enjoy yourself on those sort of high bits in life. Lectures. Not everybody's going to be there, and uh, getting up at, for a 9 a.m. lecture is kind of tough for me and other people, I'm sure. And often, not many people are there, actually, at early mornings. I found that out. Um, but I enjoyed it either way, even though it was uh, tough getting out of bed. I have to walk uh, 15 minutes to get to my lectures in the uh, forest sort of thing. Traveling again. I went, also went to Paris and visited um, my sister and my mom, sort of training it out on the way there. Uh, took the Eurostar, kind of enjoyable. So because my sister half term, I wouldn't see him till Christmas. Kind of miss family. Everybody loves a family sort of thing. And uh, I enjoyed that sort of learning curve. And I travel by yourself as well. Found it interesting. So my, uh, ooh, what would you have done differently my first year to um, my advice to um, future? Try socializing more. Even though I socialized a bit, I miss not trying other things. Um, I did airsoft. One time I enjoyed it a lot, but just time and stuff like that. So, my second year plans, so again, socialize with friends more, try to get out more, and just sort of looking towards the horizon and a bit more organization on that note, because it's, I'm not the messiest or most organized person out there, so I gotta work on that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So, uh, does anyone have any particular questions for Christian? Oh, Alia, always a question. Okay, so what's the uh, what's your favorite meal that you've kind of invented? What's your go-to? I like everything, but I do agree. Fry like egg fried rice is pretty good. You get that nice balance. It's like I'm the type of person like said one pot dish. Put everything in one pot. Easy to store. Easy and um, just. I like making a bunch of it and then just storing it for like snack time sort of thing. I do, eat, I do enjoy eating, so gotta say it's pretty good. Christian! Hi, Tanya. <laughs> yes, he's my godson. Um, tell me, what would you say to Camille before she goes to university? as the one thing you didn't expect. So to tell everybody, Camille's my sister, she's 17 year old, she's in the back right yeah. there in the white hat, waving right now, looking embarrassed. Um, my advice is uh, just live in the moment, have fun and keep an eye, open eye for everything because university can be a lot of different people. I'm sure all of you, some of you have been to university, you look a bit older than me, just a bit. And, uh, you know, I think just keep, even now, you should keep an open eye and uh, I sort of take that now and I'm, that's why I'm doing this talk, so. We have one more question. Hi, what do you think you could have done to better prepare now that you know what you know? Practice cooking a bit more. Um, <laughs> organizing myself better, so be more like, have my parents there to support me, but even though I was pretty good, I did IB at BHS, um, so I was re did pretty decently in that, but just to organize myself a bit more in anticipation, sort of create good habits in getting that sort of rolling start from it. Thank you. That's it.